Hi everybody, welcome to Don't Starve Adventures Switch Edition. What better place to start than right here? I played as Wilson uh, up through level or day eight, and that gives you just enough XP to unlock Willow. I know this because I own Don't Starve on basically every platform imaginable, and so I know exactly what to do and how many days I need to go and play in order to unlock Willow. And then I basically ignore everybody else. Uh, let's go ahead and do like a short series. Let's go ahead and bring back for like a season, like a short season here uh, of some Don't Starve Adventures. I have been asked numerous times uh, while this is actually going. Let's go ahead and uh, uh, let's go to my menu here because uh, it takes a while to generate the actual world. Uh, when I go to BlizzCon, actually, yeah, the last time I went to BlizzCon last year, uh, it was mentioned twice by two different people. It'd be weird to mention twice with, from the same person. Uh, and I thought that was odd because I didn't necessarily feel like it was a, something that people were like they loved. They really loved as part of this channel. So, uh, Rise of Giants says, uh, let's, let's, let's make it, uh, um, oh no wait, has, I think there's a way to make it compatible. Uh, I think when we actually get in we'll see it. Rise of Giants or, you know what, let's do this. Yeah, let's do it. Let's uh, let's do it's switch and I don't think we've done very much coverage on uh, on shipwrecked So let's do that Actually, no, I lied. We're gonna do this. Why because there is a way to make it compatible with shipwrecked. Let's do that Perfect. That's what I want to see um, So this part takes quite a while I'd imagine because the the switch has nothing on uh, on the bulk of an actual PC rendering a world uh, I don't remember how long it took to render on my phone. Yes, I have it on the phone. Uh, <laughs> or on my iPad. Or, or actually, wait, does that, is it on, uh, on Android? I'm not quite sure, actually. Um, but, yeah, this part does take quite a while on the uh, on the Switch. Uh, anyways, yeah, I'm, I'm, I am thrilled to be able to jump into something new. The Switch Edition. Playing on a, on a, on a Switch controller, which is the best fucking controller out there. Um, and... Record a handful of these episodes. I'm a little rusty, though, I should note. A little bit. We played Don't Starve Together on stream for a little while. I thought that was kind of fun. Um, but it became a little hectic. Like, it was difficult to, like, really get in there and, like, you know, basically play the game as you, you typically play it. Because, you know, you play the game as a single player experience. Don't Starve Together is not that. <laughs> you get on and, you know, oh yeah, I was on yesterday. Why is it, why is today is 200 days later? And why does everybody have like a magic, a mass, massive fortress? <laughs> so you end up like kind of feel like you're falling behind a little bit. And then everybody's stuff is everywhere. It's kind of like walking into a, uh, a dorm and having just like <laughs> everybody's room is just completely fucked at everything. That's what it felt like. Let me go find a place in the corner over here by the janitor's closet. I'll just go ahead and sleep here for the night. I'm drunk enough. Um, but yeah, look, still loading. Still going. Still going. So yeah, in terms of like, what we're going to be recording here. I'd say, pal, you don't look too good. You better find something to eat before night comes. Uh... Yeah, like I said, let's do a season. I don't know how long a season will be. It'll kind of leave it a little open to me, right? To determine that. Some gold already, what up? I just kind of see where it goes. Like I said, somehow this is the most... What the fuck is all this gold? Somehow this is the most... Well, I guess next to Tets and Will Donkey. Um, <laughs> and of course, we're Darnell. Uh, it is up there as one of my top rated and requested shows. Just, just insane. I play a game for fun. And you guys actually like it. <laughs> I'm being facetious there, of course. So I think the first thing we're supposed to, we need to do here, uh, is clearly go and get all this gold? The game's just serving me up gold. Nine pieces of gold. I can make so many opulent, whatever. Oh god, there's a mandrake over there. No thanks. Was gonna big big loop big laps right now. Um, so the controller configuration—if you're not played it yet—it's actually pretty good. Like seriously, it's actually really good. Um, that little uh, drop down or that little uh, tooltip disappears. There it is. It disappears uh, after a little bit of time. It didn't disappear for some reason on the lighter there, or maybe I kept on nudging it. No, no, no. It definitely wasn't. Uh, 
see that the lighter was bugged. And then what you do is you hold down the left trigger or the ZL on the switch. And then you can go through and scroll and pick everything you want and then just hold, hit A to like build whatever it is. It's actually a really, really simple uh, setup. I yeah, should might as well make some of these now. Um, and then if you want to organize your inventory, you could just use the, the right thumbstick and it's just like just go over here and then and then here's the part where it gets a little funky, right? Like when you you can you can use your mouse and then like on the PC, you could use the mouse and then organize your inventory while you're walking. Um, in this case, though, you can't necessarily do that unless you like start doing some kind of weird stuff with your fingers, because when you're walking around, you're using your left thumb, thumb right? When you want if you want to organize something, you'll have to do this. So let's say let's move this carrots, right? Let's move these carrots to the far end here. I'll move this, actually. So while I'm running, I'll just tell you what my thumbs are doing. <laughs> First of all, you pick up some of this grass here. Uh, so let's see. Right thumb is reaching over to the D-pad. And uh, what was the button to pick up? Shit, I forgot. Hold on a second. Uh, I guess. Oh, never mind. You can't move it. Like, oh, so you have to go like this. Yeah. So then you select. And then, oh, jeez. Then you select. And then you move it over. And then you drop it. Yeah, You so you can't, you can't organize your inventory while you're like running around. Um, and using things, like I said, that's when it gets a little bit funky, right? So if I want to eat this carrot on the go, so, uh, I basically, with right thumb, and then I have to reach over, and then hit right, and then hit, on uh, the, uh, so basically my right thumb is not underneath my left thumb on the D-pad, and I'm kind of, like, running in laps here, just like I explained this to you. So I want to eat this, I'll just basically hit that while I'm running. Now, the only reason why I bring this up, is it's like, oh, so what, the butt's a different, different place. Sometimes, <laughs> sometimes, shit is hitting the fan. And you need to like, I don't know, hot swap to some better armor, or hot swap to another weapon, or maybe hot swap to a cane, uh, so you can move a little bit faster. Uh, and that's a little bit of a pain in the butt <laughs> when you're, uh, you know, you could, you could, well, you can't do that while you're running. You have to, I guess, right trigger and then grab it and then move it. So in this case, I could grab the lighter and then over here, and then I guess we can keep moving like that. In this case, maybe this isn't getting used to. Maybe I'm just being curmudgeon. That's what it is. I'm okay with that. You know, I'm actually two years older than like the last episode of Don't Starve. Pretty certain the last episode of that was like two years ago. So yeah, let's just call let's just say I'm being curmudgeon. I'm being a grouch. Take all this up. First day is always just just pick up things. Everything. Doesn't matter if you don't necessarily need it. Just pick it up. You'll eventually, you'll burn through it all. And then, by the time you get to like day 7 through 10, you start realizing that all of your absurd running around and trying to... Oops, that's an attack. Uh, trying to pick up everything. You've neglected picking up or going out and actually farming up some food. Whether it be building traps and using them or maybe being a little more diligent about looking for berry bushes or something or beating up pigs or those little eye ostrich things okay that's the other thing i'm not gonna remember any of the names of any of the, any of the shit in this game it's crazy oh the snuff uh, i i i'm what is that actually called wow never mind yes yeah, so that's what it's called that's what i called it before and that's what i'm calling it now that cute little elephant thing woolly mammoth elephant thing that you end up killing for for fat loots. But it's a huge bitch to actually track down a trap, though. I'm curious, though. Like, if any of you guys have ever tried to play Don't Starve on mobile, the mobile experience for Don't Starve is actually not that grown. I was really disappointed in it. Oh god, see, here we go, here we go, here we go. These guys. Okay, hold on a second. Let me see where I'm at here. Let me see if I could get close enough to the market on the map. Torch get low. Here they come. Here they come. Lots of pig. Oh boy. There is a whole lot of action going on down there. <laughs> oh my god. Okay. There's enough to get on the map? Sure is. Oh, it stands right out too because all the berry bushes. Beautiful. Yeah, that's gonna be a tough one to overtake. I think um, I'll probably use them to farm some weapons out there with the uh, tentacles. That's a good plan. 
Now, I know what you're thinking. You're thinking, is this guy ever going to make a fire or a torch or something? And the answer is yes. In a minute. Kind of make it last all night. Oh, I guess I do have the... Nah, let's make it. No, nah, there's no... There we go. Let's put it on. There we go. <laughs> oh, man. All right, let's do this to save a little bit. Let's do this. Okay, so we'll light this and then unequip. There we go. Oh, shit. That's not what I wanted to do. Fuck. I, <laughs> I didn't really want to set fire to everything. Here, I'll... I'll Oh, because that's not the wrong button, sorry. Uh, plant, right. Okay, right. Go, go, boop. Ah, oh, shit. This again. Wait, wait, wait. Boy, they give you some leeway, don't they? I'm afraid to light another fire, to be honest. I'll just hold on to this to the end. I don't want to light too many things on fire. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, wait just a moment, then we'll get started again. Forty-three percent, forty-two percent. This thing's barely gonna be worth the uh, the space it takes up in the bag. What if it gets too low? I'm not gonna chop those trees for charcoal yet. They're kind of useless at this point. All right. Oh, wrong button. Oh well, fuck it. yeah, we'll just drop it off somewhere. We'll just drop it right there. Whatever. One day I may need it, but not today. All right, let's see. Plant. Plant all these. Do our part. Yeah, let's leave it there. I'll eventually come back around and be like, oh shit, a torch. Why did? It, why is this here? That's about how deep my memory runs. All right, let's see. Equip this. Get some chopping. You can hear the rumbling. The rumbling of those uh, tentacle arms. Probably one like right here. Right on the edge. No? Well, I am a shot. Well, I guess I guess we would see some clue that they were there because of the uh, the bees and everything floating around. The tentacles would have come out and so we some ass. Ah, there's one right there. I knew there was one right close. Whee! All right, let's see if these guys have uh, farmed us up any. Yep. Look at that. Beautiful. Oh, and they got them too. So I'm be careful. Cool. Hey, we got some meat out of the deal. What are these guys doing? Are they sleeping? Nah, they're still awake. All right, cool. <laughs> yeah, we'll come back and take care of them later. Oh, uh, shit, I know. I, I take that back. I don't know if we'll ever take care of them in the sense of, you know, let's go over there and stomp some face. It's more like we'll use them to farm up some more tentacle arms as we need them. <laughs> don't take that flower. Don't take that flower. Oh, you can take the flint. Oh, that's even worse, actually. No. They drop a little, little meat nuggets. Eat this, eat this. A little morsel. Got a good amount of food right now, actually. Now let's make a hat. All the way down, the door, make one of these. By the way, it's funny, the uh, save, the auto save is in the middle of the day. I seem to recall the auto save on PC. And again, it's been a while. Uh, happening in the middle of, uh, or, or at the very beginning of the day. The, the light would, the, the sun would come up, it'd play a little jingle. Do, 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 right? And then you'd get a save, an auto save. But this, this happens in the middle of the day for some reason. Perhaps it's because you start off? No, you start off in the morning, actually. Hmm. I don't know what the answer to that is. I have 4% left on this. Stupid axe. Point. Done. Okay, a good amount of food. Wow, jeez. That monster meat, we could just cram that right now because we're not losing any sanity. Like, we're seriously, like, it's so easy to recover sanity the first couple days. Everyone's so fucking happy. <laughs> Let's see. Ah, 
of seeds, huh? Let's go and drop these guys. Plants, rather. There we go. So yeah, what we'll probably do is do this in like 30 minute segments. Because I feel like the original, the original Don't Starve, uh, we were pushing like 45 minutes, sometimes an hour. Like rarely an hour, but it happened. Uh, I don't want to do that again. I think 30 minutes, 30 minutes seems cool. That seems like a good spot. Just nothing but this. Actually, let's go ahead and make a quick fire. Um, and just cook some of this meat here. Oh, jeez. Wow. Wow. It's like I summoned this thing. Oh, man. Fire's gonna go out, like, instantly. Hold on. Let's cook. Let's cook the monster meat and eat that first. Uh, let's see. Cook. Oh, jeez. Should we do that? Yeah, we should. But the other thing we should do is make one of these and then put it on. A bit funky trying to go through the equipment here. There you go. That'll keep me. Uh, but we should put something on the fire before it goes out. There we go. No, oh, don't eat it raw. God, Jesus, girl, what are you doing? What are you doing? You eat this. Yeah, eat this. Sandy, go down a little bit. Uh, and what we'll do is... We can't... Can we build anything? Straw suit. Can't build a backpack yet, right? I think we have to actually science a backpack. Oh, good, the rain's cutting back a little bit. Awesome. Yeah, we need a science machine for that. A science machine requires, what? One more rock. Really? One more rock? That's the thing I'm missing. Here, let's put um, a chop a log on it. Just to make sure it's still up when we come back. Nope. Uh, let's see, how do you zoom in with this? I think it's... No. Oh god, am I upside down? <laughs> I've lost it. Wait, 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 wait what's... Oh, okay, yeah, yeah, I see. <laughs> I get lost because I can't, because it's going to run over. Right, wait, 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 real quick, hold on. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let's just cook all these damn berries. Cook all this stuff up, and then we'll go. We'll just uh, go and pick up that torch. <laughs> the torch that I dropped that I said to come back to later and forget that was there. Yeah, yeah, that one. What's nice about the controller though, in case you're wondering, uh, is whenever you try to cook and do stuff uh, in the PC version where you're using the mouse, it is very easy to accidentally eat something you're trying to cook because you have to hover your mouse over the damn thing, blah, 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 blah. Uh, that doesn't happen here because it's it completely impossible to like fat finger somehow the like right button, uh, the right direction and the left direction at the same time. Let's go ahead and eat these guys. Top off with this. Max us out. Bam. All right, cool. And then we will pick up the torch. And we'll go back and look for that rock. Where am I? Still know how to zoom in, though. <laughs> ah, the triggers. All right, down here. So we'll just basically follow this thing around. Yep. Follow the road, follow the road, Okay, let's make another one because I don't want to waste this. This is my lighter. It's got to last me to end game. Whatever that is now, I have no idea. Make a pickaxe, or maybe we get lucky and there's some rocks on the ground. Not a rabbit hole. Then we will uh, light this and then equip and then get slapping. Quick before it burns out. Perfect. And then we'll equip this guy. What was it? Right. There we go. Not so worried about the nitro right now. The only thing you use nitro for right now is. Oh, well, you know what? Let's build this. Let's build a damn thing here. Get the ashes, though. 
Actually, Ash is also useless right now. Uh, there's some flint on the ground. There it is. Okay. Fuck it. We'll pick it up. Fine. We'll pick it up. All right. Now I can make a science machine. So let's build one. Get some, um, like I said, this is the part where this is what is going to waste this torch, by the way. Um, <laughs> this is the part where we uh, now start building up our sanity again. Like I said, eating the monster meat right now is like, there's no penalty to it this early on in the game. Oh, that's right. Nitro for the endothermic, endothermic fire. All right, well, it's not winter or summer anytime soon, so we'll just put that right there for now. Uh, should we keep it fed? We can't cook anything on it, right? No, I don't think so. It's cold fire. Duh. Stupid. <laughs> uh, all right, let's see. Um, let's, well, we don't need sanity anymore, so we'll leave that there. Actually, that's going to continue to rot no matter what, uh, so we'll go ahead and put that on. All right, let's see. Tools. Shovel. Yes. And then a pickaxe. Uh, I feel like it's a waste right now. Raise is a waste right now. I like just to get rid of those things. Uh, okay, yeah, re refinement. That's what we need to do a lot of. So we'll do rope. We'll do boards. And we will do stone. There we go. Now, what kind of cool stuff we make over here? Electrical doodad. Thank God we got all that gold right at the beginning. Like, right off the bat. One more of those for this. Yeah, so one more doodad. So we need one more stone. Let's go and refine some stone. Let's get away from this here. Okay. Oh, I don't have enough stone. Oh, man. Well, damn. We'll come back to that then. <laughs> Let's prototype a couple other things first. A spear we don't need, thank god. Actually, no, we'll just go ahead and go, uh... Like I said, you got to prepare for food here. Get your butt, get your butt, get your butt, get your butt. There we go. We'll come back and see if anything happens there. We'll let it happen organically, we're not gonna bait it. Okay, yeah, so let me go ahead and eat. Oh, a little pause there. Topped off. Pickaxe. Nope. I like that the, um... I know you can do this on PC, but... I never do, because it, you know, it's stuck in my ways. Curmudgeon, remember? Um... But you can actually bind, uh, or there's a separate button for attack. Which is super handy. I, I don't exactly remember what the Mandrake does besides follow you around and just like annoy you. Um, but I know that you can use it to build something. I can't remember what it was. Something like, something that has to do with resing yourself or uh, health or something. I don't remember what it is, but. Cause we didn't see a Mandrake, right? We did, I'm pretty sure we saw a Mandrake earlier. Yeah, we're gonna make so much ropes. We might as well just do all this. Then we have to make a straw, uh, straw armor, and just yeah, there's just so much stuff. Do I need poop? You know what? Uh, let's give this guy. Let's see. Uh, can I give this guy? Oh, he won't eat that because it's not fresh. He'll eat this though, I think. Yeah, give, but not this. Oh yeah, there is give. Here you go, dude. Thank you. <gasps> Stay away. Ah, oh, come on, dude. No, he doesn't want any more. Oh, look at this picky. Picky eater. Here you go, have some seeds. Great. Hey, hey, oh, that's right, he won't shit unless it's, um... Unless it's something. What is it? He doesn't do vegetables, he does fruits, and he does... Won't he eat... Flowers? I forget. Matters not. Alright, let's go over to the right here. We'll get some more... More and more rock. And then we'll go back to our machine. And get working. So glad I got one piece of manure. Super handy. Afraid to say poop. <laughs> God damn. That's how long ago so that the last episode of this was, I think. <laughs> Man, what a damper that was. I was so upset. For those who don't know, there was an instance some years back where I was uh, copyright strike uh, was filed against my my channel. Uh, I think because of the use of the word poop, Sky Italia, 
which I guess is like the Comcast uh, of Europe or parts of Europe or something. Um, they had a content ID match on me, and when I go to the play, they play at the time, like play at you. Know, basically, if you get content ID match, it'll say click this link to play at the moment that we we found the the, the copyrighted material. So I clicked on it. And it went to a point in time in the episode where I was literally just saying the word poop and repeating it over and over again or something to that effect. Just, just the most absurd thing. Uh, I think it was happening in conjunction with a couple other things. Like some other guy was like attacking my, like filing copyright strikes and takedowns on my um, comedy, comedy, uh, what was it called? Comedy show, comedy, whatever. Whatever, like, yeah. but it's still it's just just a time that I clearly want to forget about. Let's not wake this guy up. That's food for tomorrow. All right, I think we can make it back to our uh, to our dealer here. That looks like a big ass no. Let's try it anyways. Maybe we'll use it like. Oh, now you wake up, chump. <laughs> what the heck? Stupid bird. Hold on, I'm gonna open up a drink. Oh, I can hear me gulp, huh? My apologies. Suddenly ASMR. Call takes. I gulp. Converting the whole channel. Here we go. Alright, let's see. Oh, look at that. Like I said. Organically. We have dinner. Actually, we'll leave it there for a minute. Uh, and... God, these are all gonna go bad. Whatever. Alright, let's see. So now we can make a... Uh, some more stone. Let's go away from this real quick so we can do this. We work. And let's drop in. Yeesh. I can't really afford to get rid of anything right now. Oh yeah, manure. Bam. All night long right there. Okay, so let's refine some things. Get ready for a five. I think that'll do it, right? That's the one's all I needed. Oh, no, two of those and then three. Jeez, okay, wow. Laser focused. Need, oof, need more of those for sure. Two more boards. I was like four of these or something. I don't know. I'm, I'm gonna need more of those anyways for other stuff. Uh, oh, I didn't need those at all. <laughs> I needed a doodad is what I needed. That's right. All right. So we'll make more stone here. One more stone and then two more planks. Yeah. One more stone. Get that out of the way. And might as well go to cook this. It'll actually reju rejuvenate the uh, the stack there. And let's drop this nitra. I don't want anything to do with it. It just, yeah, like I said, endothermic fire, and that's pretty much it for right now. Nothing else of value. Okay, so we need to go get how many pieces of wood is that then? So two. What was like three? Yeah, three. Okay, so six pieces of wood. All right, that's easy. That's easy. Wait, do I even have a? Uh, nope. Why don't we make an axe? <laughs> you know, for chopping trees. I'm afraid to chop these guys. They turn into fucking monsters. Yeah, I'll go up to the right, up to the left there. Plus, I think birch trees drop something else as well. I can't remember. I'm saving you for later. That's brunch. Next episode. <laughs> here we go. All right, let's get the chopping here. Uh... Yeah, so I think what we'll probably do, make, just make it a nice round number, is we'll do five days per. I think that's good. I think we did that before, actually. Then it got carried away. Um, I think five days per episode might work. I, I, again, like, assuming nothing goes wrong. Uh, because for the most part, the game doesn't pause. It'll pause if I hit the uh, right trigger. But I don't necessarily plan on playing inventory management the game. Uh, the mini game within the game uh, anytime soon. Right now, we're just gonna get our shit together. We have enough wood right now to build the machine, but I'm gonna go ahead and clear all this out. Hey, can I make a shovel? I have a shovel actually. Yeah, we'll go around and actually get all the stumps out as well. And then we'll replant the trees and do our part to save the environment and then keep on moving. We gotta replant the trees because I'm eventually gonna start, I will eventually somehow start a forest fire and I need to make sure there's just the maximum amount of destruction. 
capable. So, wow, another pine cone. Okay. Come on, you can do it. Two, one. Oh, uh, yes, perfect. Damn, that was perfect. Good. Because the next thing I'm going to make is an opulent axe. Dig. Dig. I feel like the B button for dig is a little sticky. Yeah, I did it like twice here. So I walk up to it and then B button. Oh, of course. Thank, thank you. Thank you. Oh, save. B button. Oh, that works. Okay. I just had to, I guess, m mention it. You know. <laughs> just, that's all. <laughs> just mention it. Fixes itself. 72. Nothing feels better than, like, running out of durability on a piece. This, like, on the last swing. You know? And it's just like, oh, thank God. I didn't need, I didn't need that tool right now anymore. I didn't need the tool anymore. And... Uh, I managed to, I fell whatever it was that I was chopping. Some berries, I don't know, need, I definitely don't need food right now. I'll let those things sit for now. Alright, that's enough wood. That's enough wood for today. Do, do, do. So yeah. Oh gosh, there's a snuffle over gets nearby. I'm not even gonna bother with that. Uh, oh, it was actually already rotting. Sweet. Let's murder it. Is the meat bad? No, the meat's fresh. Awesome. Uh, we'll go ahead and uh, do the same thing with these guys. I didn't realize that they actually rot in there. That's a little. <laughs> All right, one of you guys will definitely fall into this. That is just a given. So I'll be back tomorrow. Uh, let's see. Make another... No, let's see. I'll make more planks. And then... Puching. Nope. Yeah, Puching. Oh, I did make the Puching sound. <laughs> Alright, we'll put it right, like, here or something. Yeah, we'll put something... No, we'll put it right next to each other. I kind of like have them, like, super close. Boy, do I miss mods. <laughs> like, it's funny, like... The, uh, so first off, there's the mod that you can actually have both your, uh, logs. So yeah, we'll get that done. Um, you can have, uh, a backpack and some armor. That is like, that, that, I can't, I, it pains me to play without that because it's such a good mod. Not having to worry about that. Swapping out between your backpack or whatever. God, it's just so good. And then, of course, there's the stack as many bullshits as you want mod, but that's kind of OP. Night is coming. I need fire. Make a bunch of these. Okay, and then we'll make... This. Sturdy container. Put her right there. It's about as... There we go. Perfect. Then we'll inspect. Uh, I didn't plant those trees, actually. Um, I don't think I have anything I'm gonna throw in right now. Yeah, because we're gonna be burning through. Th Actually, yeah, I am gonna throw on this. No, no, we'll keep it lighter. I'm gonna get rid of these. We can do this before the day ends here. I'm gonna go plant. I seem to recall there being something with planting them outside of their biome, like it, it inhibits their progress. Man, it's so easy. Just hold, literally just hold down A. Ah, this is the best. Oh my gosh. Oh man, I hate planting things on PC. Man, this is so much better. <laughs> just hold down the A button and just walk, walk to the left and it does it automatically. You're doing it on uh, PC, you misclick and you have to like pull the damn thing out of inventory again. Man, that it was just, just that's just like so infuriating. All right, cool. <laughs> So let's see, let's go ahead and uh, we'll toss a plank in it, make it last all day. It only costs us three boards. Bow. There we go. Cool. We got all this grass. Just sitting here taunting us, and we want it to regrow too. And we should do it before the, uh, the sun sets. Ooh, hurry up. The sun is setting. Get all this together. Come on, hurry up. <laughs> I don't think we're gonna go chase over that the that that thing here, the track. 
Who just leaves dirt lying around in the forest? But we're not in the forest. What? Plot hole. All right. We're done. <laughs> that's about that's about all I could take. No, uh, this is a perfect stopping point. We're about to hit day five. We'll start the next day tomorrow uh, on day five. And yeah, like I said, it's perfect. Um, thank you, all of you guys who who basically convinced me to, to start this thing up again, because I do love this game. And yeah, I will eventually get tired of it again. Uh, but for the most part, like I do, I do have a very fond um, love for this, uh, for for the Don't Starve series. More definitely more so than Oxygen Not Included. Oxygen Not Included is a fun game, but but uh, nothing nothing has quite struck a chord like Don't Starve has. So I appreciate you guys asking me to bring it back, uh, because you're getting your wish. We're bringing it back. Thirty minutes or so a day, probably about five days a week. And uh, we'll go from there. On vacation this week, so this is probably the only content that we're going to get from this channel for uh, for this week, and then we'll pick things up when I get back next week. Thank you again for your continued support. I love you guys. Have a good night. I will see you.